Howdy, howdy, everybody. Howdy, humans. I'm back after another long four-day weekend once again. Uh, as if that isn't, like, standard or some shit like that. <laughs> uh, I hope everybody had a good weekend, though. Mine was very exhausting. <laughs> Incredibly exhausting. Work was very, very brutal. Um, Is my mouth tracking? My mouth tracking looks a little weird, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, uh, I had I had some tech issues before stream. It was beyond fucking annoying. And I got very sick of it very fast. Wait, hold on. I have a, I have a way to test. Hold up. Uh, uh, yep, yeah, that's what's wrong. That's what's wrong. I'll, ex I'll explain what my tech issues were in a second. <laughs> Let me fix this real quick. I know exactly what to do. I think. Uh, uh, use microphone. That should fix it. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, okay, no, that did not fix it. What the fuck? Hold up. Uh, what in God's green name? Wait, I have to set the microphone. Durr. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Voice meter output. Ah, uh, ah, uh. all right, we're fixed. Yay. <laughs> um, I was like, things look a little off. Just a, just a smidge. I can't say I'm a fan. <laughs> um, uh, t I had some tech issues right before stream. So I had gone to a coworker's house earlier to, um, play some Smash Bros. By the way, um, uh, I, I beat them so many times, I was making them straight up depressed. So, uh, just an average day in the life of Rise. <laughs> but, um, but that means I unplugged my Switch and I brought it over there. Because their Switch was, like, in their sister's room or something. And I was unable to, um, join them. Hold on. Just a quick recalibration. I'm a stickler for things looking right. <laughs> um, but for for real. Um, so I had to unplug my Switch. And my Switch is plugged into the same surge protector as um, my computer and one of my computer monitors. However, for some ungodly reason, whether it be the surge protector or the plug for my PC... Um, when I, sometimes when I've gone to unplug things, things get loosened up like a millimeter, probably less than a millimeter. And it unplugs my uh, PC in them while I'm doing that. It didn't do it when I unplugged my switch initially. It did it when I plugged it back in when I was setting up for stream when I got home. And by that point, I had already had most of my programs open that I use for streaming. <laughs> and um, to top it off even more, um, when I rebooted everything, when I restarted my computer after it, you know, forcibly shut itself off, um, I was greeted with VTube Studio for getting almost all of my, like, um, Almost all my settings for the program itself that weren't connected to the model. So, like, I saw my tracking parameters. I still have my, uh... I still have, like, anything that's specific to the model itself was fine. But all of the general things were not. This included things like... The fact that I have my phone connected to USB, it forgot the USB connection. It forgot to have the plugins like um on by default. It forgot to have the spout capture on by default. It forgot a lot of fucking shit. And as we just saw there, it also forgot my fucking microphone. I ain't been having a good day. There is somebody revving the shit out of their motorcycle out there. That they're going somewhere dangerous, like Michigan. Uh, I'm cracking open a, I'm cracking open a, uh, Luke Cold? 
I'm I'm cracking open a loot cold um, Zevia as my hydration for the day. Mm. Every day I wake up, I'm thankful I'm not a VTuber. Hello, Rice. Good to see you, Circuit. <laughs> uh, I always I always miss you, CC. Everybody, whenever it's um, finally time for another week of streaming, <laughs> it's always good to see y'all again. Even if sometimes y'all drive me insane. <laughs> Hope you had a good weekend yourself, Circuit. But yeah, no, I don't know why the fuck VTube Studio would forget all that shit. Like, shouldn't those settings be, like, saved in a file somewhere? Why would it be so volatile to just forget everything? I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> See, what you don't understand, Circuit, is sometimes I overblow your shenanigans for content. <laughs> As if that makes a eh, difference in the grand scheme of things. <laughs> uh, the, uh, in all honesty, one thing I'm trying to do uh, less. They probably save in a file and it got corrupted. Maybe. That might have happened. I just hope I don't have to do that again. That would be very annoying. Uh, but um, one thing I've been, one thing I kind of like real swore to myself I'd do more or do less of over the weekend is like general complaining about just anything especially shit relating to streaming because I've really thought about it and it's just like bro unless something's actually gonna come from you complaining about it like I don't know like it's something you, a friend's doing and like you need to let them know and you need to let them ha and you need to tell them like hey this this is like stupid and I want you to kind of stop because like it's, it's really straining or some shit I don't fucking know like unless something would actually come from the complaining I'm trying to not complain at least publicly whether it be on stream I've already I've, I've been complaining I've complained significantly less on Twitter for like uh since pretty early after 2.0 debut um, but, um, I'm trying to do less of it on stream as well, <laughs> but ignore the whole, <laughs> ignore the whole thing about me complaining about VTube Studio <laughs> at the start of stream. This was more general story time than just, oh my God, everything sucks. I am, I, I'm feeling sad things and I'm gonna dump it all in my fucking chat who's probably just here to watch fucking weird Dragon Man play a weird farming JRPG. I mean, that one is relevant to the stream and kind of comical. Yeah, exactly. It's just like, there's gotta be a point to it. That's kind of my rule here. There's gotta be a point to complaining. This one was relevant to stream. It was comical. It was kind of a story time. My complaining was for the purpose of entertainment. <laughs> Don't don't tell anybody that I never had tech issues and I just made up an entire um, story for uh, content. <laughs> hmm. I actually did have tech issues though. I was very fucking frustrated. <laughs> I was extremely frustrated with this. Uh, but alrighty, uh, I believe it's time to go ahead and move ourselves on over. Ooh, the harvest Stella. We're gonna harvest some Stella Artois. That's a beer. Not sponsored, by the way. Don't drink, kids. It's a. Uh, it's bad for your liver. Like your livers, please. Thank you for that circuit. <laughs> I would have completely missed that. <laughs> I had it off when I was, uh, some of y'all, mostly people on my Discord server, probably saw that notification when I was uh, testing some shit in regards to um, our whole ping situation on tabletop. And uh, because it was just like a testing shit, I had my mic turned off because I, I was voice chatting with people and I didn't want anything to like get picked up. Cause you know, like they might not know I'm streaming. Well, they would know I'm streaming, but like they wouldn't know that they were that that like things were like audible. I guess. <laughs> yeah. Which, by the way, speaking of which, like I really tried to stress test the shit 
out of tabletop. And you all know what the solution to our problem was, both not just for tabletop, for Kirby Air Ride too. Cause this was also a Kirby Air Ride thing. Um, cause that's what made me like think, okay, this is a streaming thing, not a tabletop thing. The Kirby Air Ride stream we had with Nova. Um, which was a really fun stream, by the way. Y'all should, like, go watch the mod or something. It was actually a really good time. <laughs> um, but, um... The whole... Th all I needed to do was go into settings. Go into settings. Go to advanced. Scroll down the network. And check two boxes. Enable network optimizations. Enable TCP pacing. Do I know what those things are? No. Did they fix my problem? Yes. Two fucking boxes. That was all I needed to do. All that, all that fucking bullshit that happened during the year of the Dragon Stream could have been completely avoided. These are two fucking boxes. I don't understand why they're not on by default. Giving network priority, basically. I don't know the full details of that. All I know is it fixed the issue, and I was very, very upset. <laughs> and I'm just sitting here, like, I'm looking at stream. Like, I'm looking at stream, and, like, nothing really seems to be, like, that, like, different. I don't know, maybe we have, like, a fucking second of delay extra. Boo fucking who? <laughs> but... Hmm. Like, bro, if it fixes that much... I understand why it's not on by default. But I'm sure you'll have it. You'll have an answer for that circuit because you definitely know the shit better than I do. <laughs> it's just boggling to me because, like, Jesus Christ, like it solved everything. <laughs> but I did my. We did our fucking damnness to make that shit hate us like it did last time. We were throwing cards around. We were booting up all kinds of shit. We were changing the scales of fucking pieces on the board. We were we were doing everything in our power to make that ping go up to a thousand again. The best we got was like two hundred for like a couple of seconds. So yeah, I'm mad. I'm I'm glad, but I'm mad. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, any but. <clears throat> Let us talk about Harvestella. We were trying to find that egg thing. We couldn't... I couldn't find my way to more of the map. And as a result, we ended stream there. And I said I was going to, like, try and find something off stream. I didn't do that. So, yeah. <laughs> the only answer I have on it is OBS is a shit show, bro. It kind of is, but, like... <sighs> slobs ain't much better. <laughs> slobs ain't much better. OBS at least lets you do like fun shit. <laughs> okay. Uh, trying to think of how I can. I'm trying to think of how I can zoom in on the map or something. Cause I can't. OBS is a shitty show, but it's is a shit show, but it's better than slobs. Yeah. Unfortunately, those are our only options. I don't want to use Cress's last sandwich. We do kind of need it. No, I'm just gonna scout. I'm just gonna save scum and scout. Just maybe I missed something. I don't know. But I honest to God, like we just hit this wall and I don't know what to do. Uh, hold on. Vegetable juice. Maybe. Yeah, we'll do the vegetable juice.
Wait. There's something over here. Oh, that, le that leads up there. Go away, Bloom. Level 12, Bloom. I got a stealth. Metal Gear. Hi, Milla. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're. Having, I hope you're having a well. I hope your day's getting better. I know it hasn't been fantastic so far. Hmm. Yeah, but I'm wishing you all the best. All the same, I hope I can make your day a little better playing this game. I didn't mean to write a poem there, but it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, but I'm glad you're here. Yeah. Good to have you. <laughs> I still don't know where the fuck to go to reach the egg, though. I'm st I'm still stuck on that front. Like I'm ju I'm just at genuine confusion at this point. Do you need a hint? I might need a hint. I might genuinely need a hint. And then probably a reload. Two words, potion chest. Potion chest? Haven't I gotten all the chests though? Go away. I thought I got all the chests. This is a dead end. Or I will be assaulted. Oh shit, my stamina sucks. Shit. <laughs> I didn't even realize. Hold up. Alright, hold up. We're reloading. <laughs> We're reloading. We're scumming. Return to the title screen. Yes. <laughs> Potion chest. Potion chest. Potions thrown directly at my chest. The glass breaks and I start to die. Alright, fuck it. We'll use the last sandwich. Ready? Let's go. Let me find that wall again. At the bare minimum. It was back here. That was a good workout. Just smack them, smack them again. There we go. When plant is in the way, it looks like you'll need something to remove it. Use that. Excuse me? Excuse me! In what? Realm of fiction? Of the JRPG variety? I think to myself, oh man, a plant. 
a wall of plant. How do I remove plant? Would it be garden trimmers? Fire? A bomb? Acid? Maybe acid? Acid would certainly work. But a potion? A potion! A fucking potion! The potion causes It's a potion! It's not poison! Poison! I would assume poison would work too! A fucking potion! This is just a very spicy potion. I don't fucking Think about that circuit! <laughs> you ever think about that? I have no idea what this sounds like! With the filter on! I'm definitely gonna be checking later! Oh my god. Oh my god, I hated that. Genuine, genuinely hated that. I can assault more savants. Circuit the ignition. I can finally set circuit on fire. It's been 3,000 years. Crushing lightning attack has chance to stun. While I'm here, uh. Okay. <laughs> this is fine. Will it be? Will it be? Bitch. <laughs> Every time I use circuit ignition, I just want people to reply to I just want people to reply to circuit with a bunch of flame emojis. That'd make me happy. That'd make me a very happy man. <laughs> Just like light his ass up. <laughs> this will consume one hour. <laughs> Your backpack is full. You ever think about that? Um, I don't really want to get rid of any of this. Nectar cane, that actually looks kind of good. <laughs> I'm not, I, I'm not going to lie. I, I would partake of the nectar cane. It reminds me vaguely back in a sweet summer as a child. I was with other children. And we were at the honeysuckle bushes. Getting honeysuckles and sucking on the honeysuckles, because that's what you do with honeysuckles. I'm reminded of that time as a child. Only ever had one of those, though. Um, oh, some of the only one who thinks the f small flame core kind of looks like a head. Like, it kind of looks like a bit of like a dragon's head. It looks like something out of like Monster Hunter. Like, you just, man, how do I, how do I represent this? How do I represent this right now? Hold up. I'm gonna... <laughs> yeah, no, it looks like the, okay, I don't, have, I, I, I don't have to explain shit. I don't have to visualize shit, thank God. I see a crown here, let me show, let me show you, Mila. Here I thought I wasn't gonna be using my window capture today. I get to capture Clip Studio Paint. Before it became bad. With that stupid subscription bullshit. <laughs> I have so much shit open on my PC, dude. <laughs> uh, we'll just... On. Create from clipboard. There we go. 
I did not mean to hurt myself. Mm -hmm. uh, I remember eating one as a kid. I hated it. Dude, also, dude, sugar cane suck. I can imagine. I can imagine a sugar cane sucking a lot. <laughs> dude, it's kind of wild to me how, um... It's kind of wild to me how we have, like, all of this, um... Okay, here's here's the little thing I got. I'll get I'll, I'll continue my thought here in a second. But um, sh I should move my switch. My switch is on the ground right at my feet, and I was like so close to knocking it over. <laughs> but no, like, so, Mila. So like, you you got like the crown and stuff right like right here. Okay, it kind of looks like a bit of a fin, and you got like the eye like right here, with and then like a mouth. Like, right there, with, like, really, like, jagged teeth and shit. I should probably not be using the colored pencil for this. Hold on. This is a very focused stream, as y'all can see. I'm a very focused streamer. We're professionals. We're professionals here at Rise Here 2 TM. And company. Reserved. No, we, like, we got, like, this little... This little fin right here, and then, like, this little, like, jagged line, and then, like, a little bit of a mouth right there. When a little eye right here, and like a little, a little more of a, a little more of like a little fin thing going on, is like his little nose is right there. He looks like he, he almost looks like a little triceratops almost. He's very close to it. He's just, he's just missing like a little, just missing like a horn. I'm gonna call him Chet. He looks like a Chet to me. That's his name now. Chet. I hope you all agree with me. Thank you for coming to my TED talk. <laughs> we can't see. I Are you serious? Oh my god. I hate my life. I hate my life. I had to pull it back up. <laughs> I had to pull Chet's fucking ass back up. And if you're wondering why I didn't see that comment circuit, it's because I'm down to one monitor, because the other monitor is housing my Switch gameplay. The window capture said it was capturing Clip Studio Paint. Apparently not. Apparently not. We'll do it right the first time. I did do it right the first time. Wait, you know what it was? It was layered below the game. So I had it right. <laughs> I just didn't have the layers correct. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I'm using circuit and ignition as soon as possible. Create new from clipboard. Okay, Mila, Mila, Mila. <laughs> if you have not fallen asleep yet. <laughs> this is what I'm seeing. So you got like a, so you got like a little fin, little like fin thing going on right here, and then like he's got like a little mouth right there, a little, like, a little jagged mouth. Then he's got like his little eye, like he just fling that around, and then like another, another fin right there. Bam, Chet. And yeah, he, lo he looks like a little like a triceratops. He's just missing a little horn. That's Chet. Okay, I I'm gonna double check. <laughs> I'm gonna double check that it's actually there, and then I'm going to close the window. And we're going to pretend like I never made a mistake. Good lord, I took so long on that. The screen fucking dimmed. Hmm. But no, like, I find it wild to think about that we have, like, so many things in life that, like, just tasted absolutely disgusting. Like, cocoa. Raw cocoa is bitter as shit. It is not good. I did not mean to do that. There goes two of my best healing items. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. 
And like, I heard that cocoa was originally used to like brew tea, but even so. There's circuit ignition. That circuit on fire in chat. <laughs> coffee, coffee tastes like actual dirt. <laughs> I've never been a coffee guy. I've always been more partial to my teas. No, I'll use my last good healing item because I used the other ones accidentally pressing the wrong button. You drink both, I don't. <laughs> Mostly coffee because god I need the caffeine to function. Caffeine does not affect me. It simply just doesn't work. You activated the outer stairway modus model light. Let's go ahead and save real quick. <laughs> like caffeine more often than not puts me to sleep. I will pass the fuck out after chugging an energy drink. Um, psh. I remember what I was gonna do now. Put Skylancer there instead. Well, you're not. You're not the person I hear say that. I think. I think you meant to say not the only person. I'm gonna assume that. What is that? Mm, not the first person. Yes. I gotta give a. I gotta give an asshole a um, an accent. What accent do I do right now? Um. You know what, honestly, I think I'm just gonna stick with Russian. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna keep him as Russian because I, ju I just found that funny. It's just this really like soft face, but like this hard Russian like accent. I'm a fan of it. <laughs> Looks like we can't proceed till we take out the monster. <laughs> it looks a lot bigger and stronger than other monsters. It might be a mutant variety. What should we do, Rise? Well, first we gotta take it to the sewers, then we gotta teach it some uh, ninjutsu, and then we go to New York and we stop this guy in armor that uh, has like blades on his fist and shit. And maybe put a turtle shell on it. Preferably we do all of this when it's a teenager. Wolverine, no, I was doing, it was, it, no, it's Shredder. <laughs> I was, um, I said I was a mutant, so I made a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles joke because I am funny and original. Let's see here. There's nothing for me. The wheat is being ground. Do we not have more, uh, fermenting materials? We do now. Go! Fireflight fruit. Let's see here. Are we selling anything? We are selling two wheat. Would like to sell more things, but unfortunately... I really dislike that I can't hit left and just pick the max amount of things. It's very annoying. Like, not even up or down works either. Why? And eh, we'll keep the cool leaf. Word is getting around of its skin beautifying effects. There we go. And since we got these tingle radish seeds, might as well put them to use. And to do that. There we are. 
Look at all that. Bro, low key. I know we did not wait. It was raining. I remember it was raining when we uh started today. That probably watered everything. <laughs> Never watched Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's a shame. <laughs> uh, I grew up with the um with the four kids one. That was what I had when I was younger. I also watched the 3D one on a Nickelodeon. I never watched Rise though, ironically. <laughs> Rise did not watch Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, largely because I just stopped watching TV at that point. But from the clips I've seen, it is very, very good. I'm very much a fan. Spring Zephyr, 12th Friday. Oh, we're here. What's the next thing we need to do for Cress? Read to help Cress. Hold on before sent a letter for the collecting and deliver two cool leaves. So I need another two. I need another cool leaf. I forgot where I found a cool leaf. I'll find another eventually. I'm certain of it. Uh, bu -bu -bu. You feel sleepy. Go home. Go to sleep. Like that. All right, I'm a mostly lurk now trying to get back in a dry. Oh shit, have fun, Circuit. Make sure, you definitely post what you're drawing in the server. <laughs> I wanna see it. <laughs> I know you said last time you were dusting off your tablet, so happy to see that. <laughs> uh, I'm just looking at a couple things. <laughs> Bro, somebody uploaded the entire I got pinged by in a server. It was just about how um, the entire Dragon Ball Super Broly movie is just completely uploaded on YouTube right now in English. <laughs> I am not condoning privacy. I am just letting people know it happens. It's going to take a few days on Perfectionist. I mean, same. It con the Kana piece is probably going to take still plenty of weeks, so... Yeah, it'll be a bit. <laughs> Alrighty. Level up. <sighs> More gorilla. Forgot how much the table was. Or the kitchen. Feeling upset. Time to go outside. Yeah, when I when I say like really like normal shit like ah I am going outside, I'm going to do the video gaming in the video game, you know, shit like that. I'm reminded of a um of a short I watched yesterday. Where it was just a video talking about where um like sports commentators add like nothing of value <laughs> to like the sports they commentate. And we'll put the pink aloe in there. Do I have any more wheat? I do not. Have to be brave to drink this fire flight fruit juice. It is explosive, so keep it away from fire. Uh, put that right there. Guessing the flower stores a small amount of HP. Packed generously into a jute bag. Processed food used in cooking. We'll put it in here. <sighs> but um, it, it was a video about how 
uh, about sports commentators that like don't really like add anything to the sports they're commenting like they're just being like ah yes the, in order to win this game the players are going to have to score a goal <laughs> well players want to win this game mark 110 percent 100 percent and that, that, that's just living rent free in my head mm. another thing it's pretty insane for me of all people to be talking sports shit, but I have to say one of the sports we show at the sports bar I work at is hockey and bro hockey refs deserve like a lot of respect because <laughs> like i was seeing this man like having his eyes on the game while he's like just skating around a bunch and just like completely like great like gracefully and just like completely calmly just like as he just watches everything unfold and like i i, I was just looking and i was like bro mad respect to this guy <laughs> Being a hockey ref must be a, a, its own fucking thing. That was really cool. And I talked to my, some of my other co-workers about it. And it, in like a whole conversation started about, about just how that's the case with like a lot of refs in a lot of sports. Just having a tre- Just having a bolt all across the field. Just to like... Keep an eye on everything that's occurring. It's pretty wild. <laughs> Yeah. Rise, do you think we're ready to take on the beastie? Let's do it. <laughs> I'd like to prep a little more. A little more prep time. A little more prep time. Circuit, I'm about to set you on fire. It'll only hurt for a second. I feel like I should focus for this. Let's see here. Is that better? Oh, yeah, that's a lot better. That is significantly better. All right, yeah, definitely had to definitely had to drink that immediately. Um, and I died. Nice. <laughs> Everything's okay. Everything's all right. I never died. It's a myth. I also don't want to lose more money paying grass because I want a fucking kitchen. If I had a kitchen, I would have lived. If I was able to cook, I would have been fine. No! Oh no! They bitch slap you for it. Pass down from your house. They bet they bitch slap you for it. <laughs> I'm going home. You paid three twenty-five. No, my kitchen. <laughs> Taking good care of your flying bug friend. No, I ain't taking care of shit. On the bright side, this is all done. I wasn't prepared. I thought I could cheese it. I got cheesed. The dairy industry fucked my ass. Uh, pain. Pain and suffering. 
I got aloe juice now. Uh, removes defense down of special recipe juice from pink aloe. The jelly like texture is addictive. Jelly like. You only get one cucumber? What the fuck? I'm just gonna put some lettuce in there. Only one cucumber? Has high water content, the origins of its name are unknown. Is that true of actual cucumbers? Hold on. <laughs> what's the uh, what's the um cucumber name origin? Cucumber originates in Asia. The etymology of the word cucumber. The story of a cucumber's name is simple. In Latin, the crunchy vegetable is known as cu cucumberum. So I passed up through old French as cocomber and then to English, or it was just pulled straight from the Roman root in Wy Wycliffe's first English language translation of the Bible, which does mention the veggie by name a few times. Before Latin, best guess for anyone's was. Fancy way of saying we have no idea. So it's kind of true. Sort of. Eh. A little. <laughs> uh. Anyways, we got, we've got God's chosen fruit right here. It was in the Bible. That's how you know it's true. Okay, let's see here. Throw the lettuce in there. I want to eat cucumber whole. Don't choke, Mila. <laughs> I beg. <laughs> I kind of like you and don't want to see you as a blue corpse on the ground. <laughs> that would not be ideal for my happiness. Just a thought. <laughs> How much gorillas do I have? I have that many gorillas. Uh, you know what? Let's just make a bunch of money. Fishing. Head deeper inside the heavens egg. Shut up, I'm playing a fishing minigame. Every good game has a fishing minigame. Ever sweet fish. Have you thought about eating a cucumber like corn on the cob? I've never really actually had cucumber now that I think about it. <laughs> This has never been a fruit I've looked at and be like, oh man, I I, I, I want to put that in my stomach. <laughs> hmm. We need to look at the carb count of a cucumber to see if it's keto or not. I think it would be. I think it might be. Fuck, man, I'm curious. I've got, I'm, I'm very distracted this stream. That's okay. This is chill. Cucumber nutrition facts. Welcome to Cucumber Facts with Rise Ear 2. Today, we're going to learn the nutrition facts of a cucumber. It has not a lot of carbohydrates. I could eat a cucumber. <laughs> it is possible. But what's the serving size here? One cup, one cup of sliced cucumber. Yeah, and cucumbers are kind of keto. I could eat a cucumber. Cucumbers are mostly water. Do they have like a... Like what's the kind of taste for them? Hmm. Like are they a little sweet or... Because I've never had one. Great for humans, not so great for the fish. Speaking of fish. Here's another one. A gazing cart. <laughs> mm, 
They don't taste like much. Some cucumbers are bitter, some are sweet. But all in all, make for a good thing to dip into ranch. I could buy some vegan ranch. I could see about that. There is a place that sells vegan ranch. I've never tried it yet, though. I've tried um, some vegan Caesar dressing, though, on a salad. That was good. I had, um, for a little bit, I had a salad that I like to make for just a quick little snack of, um, romaine hearts, the Caesar dressing I just mentioned, and then I also threw some hemp hearts into it, and I called it a Caesar heart salad. Gordon Ramsay fears my culinary expertise, clearly. <laughs> I just shoved a bunch of shit into a bowl <laughs> and called it a day. I don't know why I'm back here. Actually, wait, I know why I'm back here. I need to, uh, <laughs> I need to buy equipment to not die. Let's see here. Backpack. Gropely grape sapling. Farm crop bears fruit in fall can be reharvested. Ready to harvest in six days can be harvested repeatedly. Will grow even without water and grows in any season. Ain't bad. I need to go for those at some point. Simple fireproof ring and a simple defense ring. What am I wearing again? I've completely forgotten. Simple magic swordsman ring. Physical attack and magic attack. So I do have room for an extra something. Let's get a physical defense ring. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we the kitchen is decades away, but oh well. Such is life. Um. Where is it? There we go. Now we're a little better. <laughs> uh, alrighty. We are coming up on a first ad break of the evening. One of ideally at least three-ish. Technically we had our first ad break at the beginning of the stream, but we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> I'm going to then count. I was just forgetting it out of the way during the wait. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, y'all go ahead, stand up, stretch, get some water, get some snacks, do whatever y'all humans need to do, and we're gonna be back in just a minute with uh, probably more fishing and maybe talking to a few people. And it will be a very eventful, eventful day here in Harvest Stella Trois. <laughs> with all that being said, bye for now.
Dwagon returns. Dwagon is back from literally just getting up and walking around his room a little because I get fucking zoomies in the middle of stream. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. Hope you all had a good break. One thing I need to do right now. How are my jobs? Ah, I'm unemployed. <laughs> That's what. I, that's just what I'm gonna call. Not having any like things to upgrade. I'm just gonna say I'm unemployed right now. <laughs> Currently looking for work. Full of and vigor, I see. It's the pyromaniac mayor. Rise. Are you keeping well? I hear you've been traveling all over the place. But remember to set fire to. I mean rest, so you don't tucker yourself out. Make sure to keep your lighter filled with fluid. Hmm, yes. <laughs> I don't think that's quite the voice that I gave the old man initially, but eh. It's fine. Everything's fine. Also, what is, uh... What is over this way? Oh, yeah! You. You're a thing. Accessible from the world map, a fluffy creature with large horns riding one on the world map makes it faster to get around. I'll take your entire stock. Eat make a recipe. Uh, we'll come. One more. I love him. I'm very happy to have his plushies. <laughs> I'm very happy to have the marketable plushies. <laughs> it friend, it is friend. I need, I need more of them. <laughs> I need 20. Forget the fucking rapid. I want him. I want you. I want to buy you, sir. I, I, I want you to buy you. I want you to be my Minecraft villager trader. Except you're not goddamn annoying going, eh? Eh? We are fucking out. We are fucking llamas or alpacas. I forget what they are. Without that, that shit. Just going, kada kada. Now I don't feed you like little snacks. And give you like a blanket. Even though you're like fully clothed. I'll get I'll even give you this Azure Sprat, this offering. Will this make you live with me? <laughs> Ultra mean color fish, sizable fins glide the water gracefully as if it's flowing in the wind. It only has a pattern around one eye. Uh how big is backpack? Backpack have more room. <laughs> I was I was completely unprepared for that. <laughs> I got fucking jump scared by absolute cuteness. Hello again, Mr. Krabs. I'm going to sell you on the black market so I can have a kitchen. I'm gonna outcompete the crusty crab, just you wait. Hmm. Plankton will be jealous with how fast I take you down. Another ever sweet fish. Every good game has a fishing mini game. Every good game. This is peak gameplay right here. Uh, more ever sweet fishes. Okay. Is there any, like... God, I really wish there was a way to increase the size of the map. Or just look at the map in greater detail. Just by God. I pressed, like, every button. Oh my God, it was fucking minus. I bring shame to my people. My entire alien race. 
I'm such a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh my god. Open the door. Breaking and entering. Vacant house. Hey, yo, vacant house? Fully furnished and all? Bro, why the fuck was I given anywhere else? It even has a kitchen! <laughs> yo, the landlord don't mind if I just... If I just cop this kitchen, do they? <laughs> loot it? <laughs> is there is there actually shit to loot in here? I don't think there is. Didn't see anything interactable. Yeah, nah. I am mashing the fuck out of A. It's 5.50 p.m. <laughs> no, I'm being goofy. <laughs> That's appreciated. I like Goofy here. I need Goofy here. I need Goofy to come in here and do a crime. Go to court for it. I swear I'll do it again. No, there was more to my little quest. Man, there you are. Why are you hiding? Shh, look over there. What are you doing? Quit gawking and look at Milika's house. It's decided? Yes, I found us a nice house in Chitola. I think you'll both love. Chitola, I guess I'll get to work on my tan. You're like... Five. Why are you thinking about a tan right now? <laughs> <laughs> what fucking five-year-olds are in a village like this are thinking about their tan? <laughs> even they, even their, even their dad is thinking the same thing. <laughs> I didn't even read that, and I was already on his wavelength. Good fucking lord, I'm old. I'm already thinking like a dad, but I ain't any closer to being one. <laughs> Able to swim in the sea whenever I do, like does sound like a lot of fun. Going to go in to get busier from here. Oh shit, there's gonna be two vacant houses. Let's go. Well, easy. You just cross the plains and like you don't get killed by a bunch of monsters. You all you all seem to be wonderfully good at avoiding that. Y'all should have died getting that gift. <laughs> I should have walked into those planes and seen the corpses of two children. Oh shit, that, 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 that's just it. That's the quest. That 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 did that that's just it. She's yet she, oh she's moving. <laughs> Corpses wouldn't be there, we would have been eaten true. But bro, that's just a quest. It's like literally we're losing our best friend. Okay, here's some money. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for this information. We're depressed now. We're having to deal with the concept of change at the age of negative five. <laughs> Okay, so out of the corner of my eye, the wheat thing looked like it was a goddamn elephant. <laughs> uh, okay. Find the. Sow the seeds. 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 <laughs> Bam. 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 <laughs> okay, I love that. <laughs> low, low key, I, I love that. <laughs> But every day, I wake up, and I think of just the sheer strength 
The sheer Scottish strength of the man who is narrating it, narrating its accent. Just how he delivered the lines just lives rent free in my head. The game has its charm for sure. Yeah. I've been I, I've been enjoying it. Thank you for getting it for me, Millie, because I probably wouldn't have bought it for myself otherwise, because it was so turned off by the demo. Okay, we're gonna sell Mr. Krabs. LinkedIn will be very happy about this information. I don't have any more cool use still. So betting crest will take a little longer. Is it better than demo? Infinitely better. I can't, man, it's just, it's just been so long and it was just like such a like, oh man, this game sucks. And I just threw the demo away and all my thoughts regarding it. <laughs> it just ended with, man, I'm disappointed and then just gone. But I'm having a lot more fun than I did with the demo. No, oh, brother, this guy stinks. Uh, I wonder what's up here. Wasn't there a chest? Yeah, I got that chest. It's up here at the start of the game. Go do a little more fishing. Actually, let's go to that grotto over here. I wonder if there's anything new. Oh shit, it's something I can blow up. Never mind, hold on. I, I, I'm committing terrorism first. This is a priority. There was, a, there was a marketable plushie behind there. This is a very good use of resources. And Omelette on Sunday and thought about egg colds. <laughs> uh. I remember I was thinking, I, I remember I had an idea for a, uh, for a title for the video involving eggs. And then I, a title for the stream today involving eggs and I completely forgot it. And that's why we're going with the Stella Artois joke. Circuit, I love that that's what you come back for. I love that you come back for egg. <laughs> just, it just drops the tablet pen immediately open, immediately opens up the emo tab. And just type furiously like smashes the word the, the, just furiously smashes egg into the search bar <laughs> breaks mouse while clicking it and then returns to what he was doing there are no letters nobody wants to talk to me it's just like real life i need more cool leaves I am the Eggman. It's what I am. I am the Eggman. I got the master plan. I am the Eggman. That's what I am. I am the Eggman. I've got the master plan. We can get it. We can get a kitchen. You are yolk colored, so you are the Eggman. <laughs> Yeah, uh, so Jim Carrey decided that he actually wasn't convinced to um, show up for three fucking movies for the same series in a row during his retirement. So I will be playing Eggman in Sonic 3. I hope you all are very excited for my for my debut in that. <laughs> my, the start of my acting career. <laughs> uh. But dude, it is honestly crazy, dude. Like Jim Carrey is like infamous for like never showing up for like sequels and shit. And then here he is, not sh not just showing up for Sonic 2. He didn't just show up for Sonic 2. He retired. The man retired. And then, after that. There is a letter here for you. Shut up. I'm talking about Sonic 3. But, uh, like, not only that. <laughs> He retires and then comes back a third time. 
just to play Eggman. Did you play Eggman so well? Like, holy shit. Yeah, literally, there, there are two things that saved the Sonic movie. Them changing the design and Jim Carrey as Eggman. It didn't even matter that he wasn't, it didn't even matter that he wasn't, like, fat. <laughs> I didn't care about, like, the design part of it. Because Jim Carrey, I knew, was gonna nail it. <laughs> uh, I wonder if he'll actually, I wonder if he'll be uh, fat in uh, Sonic 3. Because I know he's been pushing for it. I know he's been pushing for, like, the iconic look to finally <laughs> show itself. Which is what, I, I was wondering, like, if they didn't get Jim Carrey back, I thought maybe they would wind up, uh casting someone else who like had that like the divine Eggman physique mm. so we finally see him in all his glory and like write off some plot reason of why he has like a different voice and shit now or something but no no they they got him back and by god I hope they give Jim Carrey the um Avengers Endgame Thor treatment <laughs> <laughs> I really hope they do. I want to see the tr I want to see the Eggman in his truest glory, <laughs> being played by Jim Carrey, and his design being how it is in the games. I'm very excited! I'm very excited for Sonic Three. I'm extremely excited for Sonic Three. <laughs> Unfortunately, it does come out until December twentieth, uh, so. I'm gonna be dead by then. I'm glad they gave it to Jim and not Jack Black. I love Jack, but Jim does it. So Jim does. Jim does such a good fucking job. He really does. Like he can just really nail that like egocentric scientist stuff. That's just not really a role I can see Jack in. He did a great as Bowser. For like like. like well, okay, so uh, egocentric villain, okay, yeah, he did good as Bowser, but like, Eggman's like a different kind of egocentric. He's like, he, it, it, he just, it's not just he thinks he's better than you, it's that he knows he's better than you. I don't know, it's difficult to describe, it's like, you could not like switch them with their two positions. You could not put Jack in Eggman, and you could not put Jim in Bowser. Because they just wouldn't be able to deliver properly. Who'd make a good Ganondorf? I don't... I'll be honest. I don't know my Hollywood actors well enough to think of who would be a good Ganondorf. Uh, fuck, man. I'm trying to think of people that I know. <laughs> and I don't know a lot. <laughs> the only... like in The list of actors in my head right now is... Jack Black... <laughs> Jim Carrey, Chris Pratt, and Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> and Tom Holland. And, uh, Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. <laughs> I don't think any of them would make a good in order, <laughs> but they're all I can, like, think of by name. Uh, I'll leave that to people who keep up with that stuff a bit better than me. All I do is play Vidja. Play Vidja and, dr and drink... Not hot soda. Bye bye. I said not- I said not drink hot soda, Mila. <laughs> I don't know if like, there's like a genuinely like spicy soda out there. I do call I do call sparkling water uh, spicy water though. So uh, let's see here. Where is the place that will give me kitchen, sir? Fuck! <laughs> Open up! <laughs> Let me in! I want to cook! <laughs> Let me cook! <laughs> I wouldn't know someone pour Tabasco into Coke. Dude, I fucking... I saw this lady. At the bar... At, at, at the place I work at. She was dipping her... Boneless wings. Which I think she got, like, either mild or hot sauce. 
It was this old ass lady. She was dipping them into the water. She was dipping her wings in water. So it's like the opposite situation, but like it, 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 it's similar enough. What in the absolute fuck? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. This, this, this dude, there was so much weird with this woman. Cause like, not only did she like do that, but like before that, she came in asking us for like toast. And like that sounds innocent, but like we don't serve breakfast. I would never expect the sports bar to serve breakfast. But only enough we could serve breakfast. <laughs> we have a, we have like we have white bread and we have egg in our restaurant for like other items. So like we could literally serve you like eggs and toast. It, it, it's technically possible. <laughs> eh. It's just uh but yeah, it's just like not something we do. We don't have breakfast because we open like closer to lunch. So like she came in here asking for toast from a sports bar. And then she gets some wings and she goes and does that. And don't get me wrong. This lady was sweet. Like she, there wasn't like anything personally wrong with her. But like what, what in the, coming from me, the man who wrapped a marshmallow in a fruit roll up. And thought that was good. What in the absolute fuck are you doing? I'm just saying. Was it cold water? It was cold water. It was ice water. Mm. Oh shit, hold on. Have I told y'all... Have I told y'all the story? of the guy who we have a guy who comes in the work at least it wasn't milk uh, yeah it wasn't milk <laughs> but there is a guy who also comes in a regular of ours bye bye who will just blatantly look at porn on their phone while they're at their table like this man is literally on um I'm not sure I'm allowed to say the exact site he's on, but he's on a porn site. And he's usually, and, and like, I, I've seen him do it with like his wife right across from him. You told me about, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I told you in DMs. I felt like I, I, I felt like I talked about it recently. So I was like very like weirded at, like, so I was like wondering why I felt that way. But yeah, like literally, with his like wife across from him just blatantly having like fucking bitches getting railed on that shit and like and it's just like fully purposeful too cause like sometimes I'll I'll be scrolling on twitter and like there are some people I follow that like retweet like some pretty lewd sometimes straight up explicit stuff and like but like that's just like accidental that just happens to be there I'm just trying to look at literally everything else if I see that shit I scroll past it immediately this man went out of his way went to the naughty site for naughty things and is watching the naughty things while he's munching on a burger He and he, uh, and like, I don't, I don't, I don't like, I'm not big on like picking on people for like shit outside of their control, but like, my God, this guy looks and sounds like somebody who would do that too. Like he, he just has a vibe with him. It's the, he makes me uncomfy. I think it makes some of the female servers uncomfy, too. I feel like a lot of people make the female servers uncomfy. I feel bad for them. They tell some stories. Watching someone use their meat while eating meat. He is not whipping it out. <laughs> he ain't whipping it out. <laughs> it's probably trying to get up. The man's also old, by the way. The emphasis on trying to get it up. 
Uh, but yeah, no, he is, to my knowledge, he has not actually done anything in the restaurant. Unless he went to the bathroom and did something. You know what? I completely forgot to, like, get more healing items, so I need to go take care of that. I don't even know why I went back here. I'll go get some cool leaves, though. Maybe he just appreciates it artistically. <laughs> Call me crazy. But I don't think lemon stealing whores is the art of our time. Just, just don't think that has breached into high art territory. <laughs> I don't think that was one he watched, though. I, I wasn't really paying attention to what he watched. Alright, time to light circuit on fire. Alright, we got some cool leaves, cool. We got some cool leaves, cool. Wonderful, wonderful vocabulary you got here, Rise. That was a good workout. Next, we will be saying that the floor is made out of floor. In order to win the game, we gotta beat the enemies. We'll take this chest. Get some seeds. To sow, sow the seeds. Light him on fire. Light circuit on fire. Poor carrots. I have so much Valentine's candy. Did you get a lot over the weekend? I hope your weekend was good, by the way, Milla. I, I tried to mostly leave you alone during that, since I know what was going on. But I hope you had a good one. Why? Wait, did they... Did they come up from... Did they aggro from on top of the bridge? Because, like, we went on the bridge, we came back, and they were charging at us. Okay. That can happen, I guess. My boyfriend yesterday came with me two bags of half off Valentine's candy. I have so much food help. <laughs> so you did have a good time. Understood. <laughs> uh, for. I'd help you, Mila, but I, I don't think any of it is keto or vegan. So I'm kind of at a loss. <laughs> I'm sure you'll be fine, though. Uh, get rid of these. I'm going to have so much of them over time, and I'm barely going to use them. <laughs> oh, shit. I need to turn on a... Uh, ah, ah, <laughs> I'm getting bombarded. Help! Help! <laughs> Uh, welcome in, Cringe Ninja. Good to see you, buddy. <laughs> I'm just chilling with the farming game. I'm also turning my sound effects back on so you can get the full fire experience. There you go. Are Oreos keto? No, Oreos are vegan. Oreos are vegan specifically. Dark chocolate should be keto. Jump down. Beat them up. Uh, Manzu, you have just been slowly building up points since the year of the dragon stream. Wait, were you even there redeeming shit for the rain world? I don't think you were. Yeah, no, Circuit's the one that's a broke bitch in comparison right now. <laughs> but no, Oreos are vegan, they're not keto. And there's no keto Oreos to my knowledge. No, wait, no, there are, there are uh, keto Oreos. Catalina Crunch made some. They're alright, though. They're not that great. 
and dark chocolate, uh, yeah, some dark chocolates are keto. It has to be really dark, though. Like, darker than it is, like, bearable. I ain't often there for Rainbow, because some days where I'm usually asleep. I gotcha. I was mostly talking about a year of the Dragon Rainbow, though. So after, uh, after we were done with Tabletop Sim. By the way, we need to schedule fucking... I literally tossed the monolite fragments to get more monolite fragments. I hate my life. Um, go ahead, use the return bell. And we'll craft that. We'll craft a few more. Bell. That'll do. <laughs> Why is Civil Pharaoh working? Hold up. Why isn't that one working? The fuck? Hello? Mix it up? Can you do the things I ask you to do? Wait, maybe. Hold up. I might know what happened. Little feral toggle. There we go. That was weird. I don't know why that didn't work. I have to test that out later, maybe. <laughs> I love how I love how all the toggles are on right now. <laughs> this is such a rarity. Well, what toggles are we actually missing right now? The Fumos are on, Firearms are on, Double Mouth is on. Well, Double Mouth isn't on anymore. Wait, what the fuck? Bruh! Why did it turn back off? There we go. Stay. I guess it was just delayed. That was really weird. Anyways. <laughs> uh. We had them almost all on. The only thing we were missing was Christmas. <laughs> If we had Christmas on, like, we would have had, like, every, like, toggleable thing on. Huh. That would have been funny. I am too poor for Christmas. Oh, everyone is right now. After Rain World, after the Twitch integrated Rain World, everyone's fucking broke. And I am a Grinch. Farm work and is pretty good wing exercise. Alright, don't get me wrong. The fair is, like, fine. I... Be quiet when I'm talking. <laughs> but, um, like, I want to do another Twitch integrated Rain World stream. The main issue is just, you know. Bam. The main issue is just, you know, everyone's broke now. So nobody can really do it. <laughs> I have like 1.5k, I'm vibing. You are 3.5k away from being able to make it Christmas. The economy is the issue. <laughs> uh, I would like to... One thing I want to maybe do if we do Twitch Integrated and Rain World again is... Make it so... Um, reduce the costs on them maybe a little bit. Because I would like to do Twitch Integrated Rain World like once a month for different campaigns. I think that would be cool and a good way to like keep Rain World in the rotation because that kind of became my niche game. Which it sucks that I'm not able to like really care as much. Well, I, I mean, I still care about it. I still want to play it. It's just finding good reason to play it because Expedition Mode didn't do it for me. And, cha and fuck Challenge Mode. I don't like Challenge Mode in Rain World. <laughs> I actively dislike Rain World's challenge mode. I knew we had more seeds. I wasn't crazy. Alright, get more seeds. To sow. Sow the seeds. I have no stamina. Drink milk. Uh. 
Uh, there's modded skugs, so they don't really feel like Rain World. Uh, yeah, that's been an issue I've had with a lot of the Rain World mods. Some of them go like too. Don't get me wrong, like the the more slug cats mod had a lot of crazy shit that they eventually added to like actual Rain World, but like um. Some of them go way too far. I feel like I and like I feel like they go too far without good justification. Cause like take something like oh I have mail. Hold on. We've got a plan. Thanks for all those fine a present for Milika. Mission superstar was total success. You do leave that to us. I've already got a super deeper plan. You have to keep the secret. You don't say a word to Milika. See you later. Okay. But, um, psh, one thing I was, uh, like, take a look at, like, how Dasambez does his, like, crazier slug cats. Like, think of the one that, like, goes to investigate, um, trying to remember its name. The one that also develops super cancer, super cancer, like, uh, Five Pebbles does, because he wants to fight distant frontiers. If you watch that video circuit, you might not have, but like in his concept video, I think he does. I have to say, I've not watched Task Zombies. as fuck. Okay, it's a technologically enhanced slug cat, but it came from an iterator to investigate another iterator. So the fact that it's so weird makes sense. But a lot of them don't. <laughs> it's just let's combine slug cat with thing. And don't get me wrong, the concepts are cool, but they really rarely feel like Rain World. You know? Crazy. I was crazy once. They put me in a room. Rubber room. A iterator puppet room. A room filled with skugs. Skugs made me crazy. Bro, when the fuck are we gonna use this attic? When the fuck are we gonna use this loft? There's so much real estate in here. Unused. We could rent this out. We could become the Rontiers ourselves. Become the landlord. Become the very thing I sought to destroy. Are you hitting the hay already? I'm just getting warmed up. You must come and talk to me when we're going to investigate the seas light, okay? Every day I wake up. But the repairs for the renovator now all to do is rate is rate <laughs> wait. There we go. <laughs> Slip. There are no shipments today. You're broke you're a broke bitch. A sixteen. Missed the opportunity to make a Burger King foot lettuce joke with uh, day fifteen. What's that noise? It's almost like somebody's renovating my kitchen. It's almost like I paid for that. It's almost like that's something I used money for. Hey, good morning. Did I wake you? Sorry about that. I just finished building the kitchen counter you requested. Is here a good place for it? In the kitchen? Or the kitchen counter? Can make silly, food using the kitchen counter. Silly ones. They tossed me in a cave, a dark cave, a dark cave with eyes. <laughs> I don't. I don't live in a cave anymore, though. I'm in a valley. I'm in. A, I'm in a dragon's gash valley. I made this with my body, with my fat fucking ass. This is my hand. That's my. That's where my hand was in the background. The cave days are behind us. We in the whole fucking mountain range, not the mountain cave. The whole range, every valley. With a bright green and yellow sky above us. It's completely natural, I promise. Same with the fire coming out of the ground. Also made by me, by the way. Make food, you will need a recipe and the necessary ingredients. You can buy recipes from stores or earn them as rewards, so keep an eye out for them. Eating food not only eases hunger, but it replenishes stamina, too. Also, cooking is cheaper than store bought food. It's nice trying out different meals when you're in the right mood. A recipe, eh? In that case. Shiny thing. 
<laughs> You're telling me a mountain stirred this fry? I'm to try using this recipe for starters. Simple and easy, even for beginners to master. Ah, uh, it's on the house. Consider it a freebie. Not the renovations, though. You already paid me for that. No refunds. If someone blows up, you sign the waiver. <laughs> I love that the kitchen counter doesn't even look different. <laughs> Alright, prepared the food. Look at all this food. A dish made of fresh wild leaves and little mushrooms. The flavor shine in the simple but tasty local dish from Lathe. Lathe. Ladle, ladle, lathe. Uh, refurbish the kitchen counter. You did it. The plow skill. Wow. You did it. You learned how to cook, you lazy bitch. I didn't think you had it in ya. I thought you were mentally deficient. Thank you for your continued patronage. We are pleased to announce that we are now selling new food recipes. We have a wide selection including hamburger and sandwich recipes. Learning to cook a variety of dishes will not only add excitement to your life, but is also sure to come in handy on your new adventures. Give one of our new recipes a try. Do camp rogue bower so we got dollar store harvest moon. Okay, Mila bought this for me. First off. <laughs> So I didn't buy it. I was still a broke ass bitch. <laughs> it ain't dollar store because I'm having a good time. <laughs> so shut your ass up. Dumbass boy. <laughs> Besides, it's a Harvest Moon, but it's a JRPG, and that appeals to me more than base Harvest Moon. Or Stardew Valley, for that matter. <laughs> I do own Stardew Valley, but I couldn't get into it. I've tried. More prepared you- How are you holding up, Rise? <coughs> Have you gotten used to your new life yet? I bet you're finding that you're spending more money buying seeds and expanding your farm. Have you considered buying some fire bombs instead? Well, I've attached a little something with this letter to help you along a bit. Sometimes when you get stuck from overspending, it's best to sell instead of buy. Use this only when you really need to. Like right now. I have something that needs to be set on fire. Hello, we heard you made food, so we are now selling better food because we actually have to actually start trying now. <laughs> Literally what the letter was. Okay, I got a lot of shit to harvest. I have a lot of shit to harvest, Jesus Christ. Carrot. Carrot. Okay. We'll make more lettuce juice. And we'll make more wheat. There we go. And the rest will be sold for profit. Then we're gonna go. Do many win ship? The pearl is especially black and shiny. Wait, so I have the mountain stir fry. Gonna go ahead and put that right there. Then we're gonna go to the town. We're gonna talk to the hot doctor lady. <laughs> I'm still laughing at Circuit's comment. Hello, we heard you made food, so we are selling better food because we actually have to start trying. <laughs> Shit, they're becoming self sufficient. We gotta step up our game, Herbert. <laughs>
And let's see here. We should probably go buy some recipes, maybe. If we can. Uh, homely Lathe Recipes. A collection of recipes for dishes like hamburger, steak, and sandwiches. Picnic sandwich, Lathe hamburger and egg, Lathe vegetable salad, Lathe breakfast. Our next goal is going to be these trees for sure. You want those constant yearly crops, you know? Especially if we don't have to water them. It's very lovely. Hot doctor lady. My only romance option currently at the moment. I have more mint for you. I have more peppermint. Harvest Stella in my Ostopini is a lot better than the Harvest Moon. The game has more to it. I have not played Harvest Moon, so I can't give enough of an opinion on that oh, quite yet. Oh, oh, it's so sleepy. I thought that was the guy making that noise. Can't get by without getting enough sleep. You need to be careful. I'll write another letter next time I need you for anything. Oh, okay, so I need to wait till she writes me another letter. Never mind. There definitely is plenty, a lot more meat here, though, than you would expect from, like, um, any hard, any, um, any farm sim that isn't, uh, Stardew. Because I know Stardew is packed full of content. At one point, I really wanted to play Harvest Moon, but we just couldn't get a copy of the game. That I wanted. I wanted a very specific game. Because Peanut Butter Gamer was talking about it on one of his uh, countdowns. Stardew is a prime fishing simulator. Interesting. Hmm. Even has farming in it as a side thing. <laughs> That's kind of sad. It's just like Animal Crossing. Fishing is just infinitely more profitable. All right, select destination. Not that. I'm still mad about the fucking potion to get rid of plant bullshit. That made me upset. Skip event, yes. Ah, flashbang. Light circuit on fire. We go. Keep a close eye on my health. Okay, that won't do anything. Falcon punch. We're doing a lot better. Get some eats. Do I get the light circuit on fire? Yes, I do. You almost got it. There we go. We only needed one thing. <laughs> that one was tough. I'm not sure how we pulled that off. Uh, I learned how to cook. Stop right there. I can't explain it, but something's off. For starters, this plant has mouth. Plants usually do not have mouth. It is not a Venus fly trap. <laughs> it's regenerating? No, the tissue is multiplying and repairing itself. What does that mean? If my gut feeling is correct, then attacking this thing without a plan will only end our demise. I agree. I think it's best we cut leave and come up with plan B. Let's go back to my place. Oh, asshole. You're so forward. <laughs> All that just to get my ass kicked and be told to get the fuck away. 
I am upset. Will we ever reach egg? I need to get up to egg so I can meet our lord. Lost to the boss intro, apparently. All right, time to go on a date with asshole. And also uh, to uh, damage all of Circuit's retinas with the color pink. How will he ever recover when I play Kirby? Like, actually play Kirby. Man, I'll be in misery. I will call in sick that day. <laughs> uh. Uh. I can't believe a creature like that was able to regenerate. The hell was that thing? What's indeed? What's on your mind, Aria? I wonder if it's okay to say. It's not like I have anything conclusive. <laughs> we do not have anything else to go on. If you know something that might help, then please say. <laughs> oh, no, I was just thinking the plant was a little hot. <laughs> but everything I mentioned from here stays between us, okay, asshole? And monsters restored it, really. It resembled something like technology we had in my time. It was called a Band-Aid. <laughs> I'm excited for upcoming events. <laughs> oh boy. Am I going to suffer, Mila? I mean, I've suffered enough. You're time traveler? I didn't think such thing existed. <laughs> Inside of Heaven's Egg looks very much like a research facility from my era. I've seen it on the news once. The Darwin Institute of something or another. I think their end goal was to create a na biosphere of nanomachines to speed up self-regeneration. Can I get a nanomachine son in chat? Can I get some Armstrongs up in here? I'm sorry, that must be a lot to take on. In any case, I think that to defeat a monster, yeah, we need to do one crushing bro. Thank you, Circuit. Nano machine, son. <laughs> Maybe if I work out a whole punch. <laughs> we don't have time for that. Dude, I want to work out again so badly. I haven't done it for a few weeks because my back's just been fucked up. I really need to do my stretches. If I do my stretches, that'll fix my back enough for me to do a l workouts for a few days. And my back will get fucked up again, and then we repeat this process until I fucking die at this point. Or I get back surgery or some shit. That ain't happening for ages. Or ever. Only if I become like the number one streamer on Twitch or some shit will that ever be feasible. <laughs> Or the world's greatest economist or some shit. I don't see anything around here that could halt the nano machines either. Something that can take out the one below. Yes. The Sarbama. Maybe the shadow assassin can help? Delia, did we wake you? No, I was already awake. <laughs> That's such a cool name. Reminds me of my OC Cold Steel the Hedgehog. Sound like you would love that moniker for yourself. It will be. Give it time. I remember the day I was helping the tiny little library at the orphanage. I read a really interesting book and got so caught reading it that I totally forgot about cleaning. And then I knew how to kill people. Since I'd only been in the town for a little while, I found it really interesting. Yeah, a section about Shadow Sashin who took refuge in Nemia. But assassins are supposed to be awful people. Why would the town protect someone like that? Book said the assassin wanted to leave life behind them. Like Egg's Dark Brotherhood assassin. <laughs> From Skyrim. The interesting part is they specialize in taking out targets in one shot by striking weak spot. Like the groin. 
Now I understand. You're suggesting we find the Shadow Assassins and ask them to help us. No shit, you dumb bitch. <laughs> Not sure if an assassin's the right call, but we really don't have any other option. Asshole, why don't you go try to check for the orphanage library? You might be able to find more information on the Shadow Assassin. <laughs> so consistent on my voices. Uh, I wanna I wanna hang out with the kids again. No, I don't. <laughs> Definitely better than doing nothing. I hope you don't mind, but I'm going to stay here. I'm not feeling well at all today. My ears are ringing like a voice in my head calling to me. Telephone. <laughs> but now we make way to orphanage. Thing is, I'm completely consistent on asshole. I'm 100% consistent on asshole. <laughs> Alrighty. We got another ad break coming up for the night. So... I will go ahead and get us all set up for that real quick. Y'all go ahead, get some water, stand up, stretch, get some snacks, use the bathroom, do whatever y'all humans need to do. And we're going to be right back in just a minute. The sound effects were broken and I was unaware. <laughs> uh, but yeah, with all that being said, bye for now.
Howdy, howdy, everybody. Hope y'all had a good break. Let's go ahead, jump right back in. Also, I saw you, CC. Welcome in. Hope you had a good time at your classes or your job, whichever one you were doing today. Uh, had a good day. I had a good day in my class today, actually. Mm. My econ class was all right, and astronomy. I, I, I tweeted about this earlier. But I find it funny that, like, whenever there's, like, a weird thing that happens in space, like a planet's rotating a weird way, or, like, there's craters that, like, don't make a particular kind of sense, or what have you, or, like, the core of this planet is too big, like, nine times out of ten, the explanation is just, oh, yeah, something big hit it. And that's just funny to me. <laughs> It's like, man, Mercury has, like, a really, like, big core in comparison to the rest of its size. I wonder why that is. Something big probably hit it. <laughs> it's because of you. No, I only crashed onto Earth. Most of these planets weren't really worth much. I also forgot where the orphanage is. Guess I have no sense of direction. It's up here. It is up here. There's much up here. You sure you ain't bumping anything else? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I, I took a stop on, like, Jupiter. That was about it. Hmm. Uh, asshole, welcome. We weren't expecting you here today. Got the, bro, bro, bro! Her <laughs> Homie, those fucking hips! <laughs> Jesus Christ! That's almost comically large! They got a fucking hourglass figure, that's a goddamn vase! Jesus! I mean, I would, but... It, dang! <laughs> Estina, perfect timing. Is it really? Would you mind take, letting us take a look at the library? <laughs> might be a last tat, tatzel she thinks her dad might have caused any. <laughs> I never took you to be a workworm. Smash, yeah, absolutely smash. I absolutely would smash. It's just like, holy shit, that, that waist to... The fucking waist to hip ratio <laughs> is... Astronomical. <laughs> What's brought this on? I wonder if it has something to do with your friends there. But right, I forgot to introduce you. This is Arya in the rise. This is Istina. She look after children here. It's a pleasure. She also built like fucking dump truck like goddamn. <laughs> Shouldn't take me long to find since Telia organized everything. We're looking for record of Nemia that include information on Shadow Assassin. Morag good with the kids. She does kind of have Morag vibes, ain't gonna lie. Just a little bit. <laughs> it's, it, 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 it's just Morag if she went, like, if she specked entirely into the other side of the gender spectrum. <laughs> uh. Because I know there was a whole thing about uh, how some of the characters didn't know that Morag was a girl. <laughs> I think Rex was the only one that was, like, fully aware. Shadow Assassin. Apparently they were able to kill their targets with a single blow. Have you heard anything about it? Hmm. And why would you be looking for something like that? Rex has good instincts. Indeed. <laughs> now it makes sense. I'd never expected a monster like that to be inside the Heaven's Egg. I don't think you'll have much luck asking the assassin for help. Makes you say that. Well, I don't know the particulars of why they came to Nemia of all places. They did come to leave that life behind them, didn't they? They probably don't want to kill anything anymore. 
been attracted to cat. <laughs> he's, he's using so many melee emotes right now. Living after taking the life of another is not an easy thing to do. Oh, uh, I see. Okay, but it's Tina, consider. Because you're totally not the Shadow Assassin. Why would you be the Shadow Assassin? Consider that this is just a plant. We're not asking them to kill a human. They wouldn't need to deal with that kind of guilt again. It isn't, it isn't that simple. Your heart is forever tainted once you have someone else's blood on your hands. Okay, so does this mean you are vegan? <laughs> Like, what are you eating? <laughs> if you wash the blood away, the crime itself remains. <laughs> like, if you're against killing, like, what are you eating? Are you at least vegetarian? <laughs> like, I'm just saying. That I might have a waifu. <laughs> Not something you easily forget. No, I'm the Shadow Assassin. <laughs> Shit, they put Mila in the game? No wonder she wanted me to play it so badly. No wonder they were dead set on it. <laughs> you seem pretty knowledgeable of this sort of thing. Almost as if you have first-hand experience. <laughs> I wonder why that is. Question mark. <laughs> Maybe we should start over. Are we really back at square one? There's no need for that. The seeds have been sown. Like in, like in harvest. When you farm and harvest Stella for the Nintendo Switch. Surprised we were able to find the Shadow Assassin so easily. <laughs> we got pretty lucky. I just hope my bluff worked. I thought that might drop their guard if I pushed a little harder. I'm sorry. You've completely lost me. That is Dina. Whichever way you look at it, she's clearly the Shadow Assassin. Could anyone but the Assassin have been able to speak on her behalf so elegant? God damn it, you know what I just realized? Guys, it's all a pun. It's all a pun. She has a giant ass and she's an assassin. It's all a joke. Say I'm wrong. <laughs> now I really want to marry her. <laughs> She isn't your, uh, dude. I know the ratio I saw. Not going to be easy, though. What do you think we should do? Oh, Suka. I just remembered. I need to go to give Delia medicine. She's probably sleeping. This game is like, here's your life when she appears. <laughs> So I see we see who Miller romance. Gotcha. <laughs> and here I thought she was simping for asshole. Mine hasn't yet. I'm gonna be real. I, I low-key wasn't paying attention. I was too busy thinking about... um. I was too busy thinking about the pun. I mean, I'm still gonna hold out for more options. I'm not jumping on the Yastina train yet. I'm very picky about my romance options. Unless something comes up and smacks me in the face like Yukiko. Because by God, Yukiko smacked me in the face with her fan like five times. I married an asshole, but she's close. <laughs> <laughs> If I went female, it would have been her. <laughs> Delia, I'm home. 
Thoughts on fish ladies. Define fish lady. Are we talking mermaids? Are we talking Zora? Are we talking Undyne from Undertale? Because it really depends on the execution. Mifa is cute. Yeah, that's why that's why it's like there's a scale. There's like mermaids to undine. I'm not into undine. I'm gonna be real with you. <sighs> Doesn't seem to be here. To be honest, everyone kind of has a crazy waist to hip ratio. Like the more I look at it, like bro, look at asshole. And, like, I've already made jokes about my dumpy. Part human, part fish. I guess we'll find out later. <laughs> I am, however, scared of fish. Like, all fish? Or just, like, certain fish? Like, in the ocean? Like, if I, like, if I put a goldfish in front of you, are you gonna scream? She said she wasn't feeling well. I got a bad feeling about this. Hmm. It's definitely unexpected. Come on, let's go out and look for her. Fish corpse is more scary than man corpse. I can understand that a bit. I don't know, man. The thing is, I have seen a, uh, I have seen a dead body. It wasn't like it, was, it wasn't like a fucking. It was an open casket at a funeral. But the feeling of seeing that versus a fish, at least for me, is uh, a very different feeling. A significantly different feeling. Same, but the first time I saw an open cask, I was completely fine. I, my interaction pretty much went as, oh man, oh, uh, oh, uh, I was there for probably like 10 seconds at maximum. Like, I could not like stare at that long. Especially when it was somebody that you like, you knew, but you didn't like knew, knew. It was somebody I knew in my life, but, like, I never interacted with them that much. But, like, it was somebody I saw, like, walking around, like, talking. I, I, I talked to this person. I've had conversations with them. They're on good terms with people in my family. And now they're not moving. Up in Casket are still caked up in makeup. It's not a true dead body. That is also true. I don't think I could, that if, if that's how I'm reacting just to that, I'm not sure how I do with an actual dead body. Only had tears of zombie fish piling up to bury me. Like, it's not that I'm saying like it's valid, it's just like, that. that's just so oddly specific. Was it like a bad nightmare that started this, or... I'm not saying, like, I'm not saying, like, oh, man, what, you're scared of fish? Like, what are you, a fucking pussy? Like, nah, nah, fears are fears. It's just, like, that's an oddly specific, like, image. There you go. That was the word I was looking for. An oddly specific image with zombie fish piling up to bear you. Observation deck of the orphanage. No, monsters, at this time. It looks like they're flying towards the uh, orphanage. We have to go now, the children are in danger. Go ahead, get our ass up here. All of our thick asses.
You're doom monsters. We're all monumentally caked up. You won't be able to stop us. Yes, bad nightmares. Toddler and little kidney had a lot of those. They came up from the drain while I was in a bath. Got my traumas earlier in life. Gotcha. Hmm. Understood. Istina. Asshole. Entirely self-inflicted, too. Hmm. Will you leave this place alone? She killed them in one blow. Brain just worked against itself. Hmm. Trying to think of my, like, most oddly specific fear. Um. I kind of have a thing with anything that flies. That isn't like a bird. Actually, even even kind of birds, but it's to a significant lesser extent. Anything that flies around like really sporadically and stuff sets off all my all my fucking fight or flight. Like it sets every inch of it off. I cannot stand shit that flies around. Fine. Let's say I am the shadow assassin. What difference does it make? I told you before, I won't use those skills anymore if I can help it. My oddly specific fear is baby monitors. I can see how that would be foreign. Baby monitors are so fucking loud. <laughs> eh. Dragon Man hides from drones. <laughs> well, no. I, honestly, a drone is like nothing. Like, a lot of it is just like the sporadicness and like the flapping especially. It's like the unpredictability. A drone is significantly more like predictable than the way it like moves and stuff. But like put like say even a moth in a room with me and I'll be like, nah, get, get that shit away from me. Move it, move it, go, go. Bad, bad. <laughs> dragon man creeper, dragon man creeped out by a dragonfly. Unironically, unironically creeped out by uh Unironically, kind of, um, not about dragonflies. There was once a dragonfly in the, um, factory I used to work in. I was, like, barreling right fucking towards me, and I, like, fucking ducked under it. I was like, uh, yeah, 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 go away, go away, go away. And, like, everyone saw me, like, dodge it. <laughs> and, like, all smiling, so I was like, eh. I'm terrified of moths. Yeah, I'm not big on moths in re IRL. Now, online... Um, as we said, Juniper Actius is my inspiration, but in terms of, uh, IRL, don't get me wrong, some pictures of moths are really cute, like the really fluffy ones, even some of the less fluffy ones, but, like, when I see them in real life, they're just, like, going all around the place, like, no rhyme or reason, and they're, like, flapping their wings, like, 500 million times a second, and it's just, like, I don't like it, I don't like it. I don't like shit that flies. <sighs> Get that shit away from me. Bad. I prefer Venom off the butter three, Butterfree. I can't agree with that. I can't agree with that because Volcarona exists. So Venomoth can't even be better by virtue of being a moth. <laughs> I think but I like Butterfree's design more. Dust stocks, I would say I like more than Butterfree, though. Oh, dude, the other day I saw my first flying cockroach. I don't like that image. Oh, yeah, another thing. And this will be ironic. Um, beetles? Fuck beetles in real life. I'm sorry, Alex, if you ever happen to watch this. I love I, I love you, girl. You're the homie. You're my homie, Alex. I 
the fact that beetles can fly is a goddamn affront to nature. Nothing that big should be able to fly like that. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I'd have a flamethrower or airsoft gun for that. Yeah. Don't, don't even, don't even, just, just burn the house down. Just fucking burn the house down at that point. Get that shit out of here. Yeah. I do have an airsoft gun for spiders. <laughs> uh, spiders, I don't really care about too much because they're grounded. They're grounded. They're much more predictable. When that shit has every fucking range of movement it could have, that's what I'm like. Eh, no, 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 no. You, you stick to two dimensions. You stick to two dimensions. Up, down, left, and right. Don't you dare add height to that shit. Fuck you. Mm. And crabs too. Crabs. Um, I can understand. You know what gives me the heebies though? Barnacles. Barnacles are, yeah. Uh, Barn I don't have trypophobia, but barnacles give me trypophobia. Oh man, I'm so glad I found you. Wait, Bandic, monsters already dealt with. Let me speak, would ya? It's that girl you've been looking for. Teely, was it? The monsters took off with her in tow. What did you just say? I don't know what they got planned, but they took her back to the Heaven's Egg. Whatever you're thinking of doing, you best do it quick. Thank you. Did you know new types of cockroaches are found at aquariums often? I fucking hate today. <laughs> I hate this conversation. I keep learning things I don't wish to know. Uh... Potential future wife, come with us. This is Tina. Go kill them all. Spill their blood. Make them regret the day they ever came here. <laughs> Ludi spinal cord sword. Those monsters just now, you'd be lots of help. But I need to stay here and look after all of you. No, you don't. We have Falatobs back in the orphanage. We are absolute delinquents. <laughs> we learned it from watching you. We want to kill people just like Mrs. Tina. All right, you say stone spinal cord sword after that. I mean, I thought you were just going on about stuff. I was just kind of nodding my head like, uh-huh. That sure is that thing you just said, Cece. Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> Chainsaw man, yeah. Uh huh. That shirt is that thing you just said, Cece. At this rate, I'll, I'll, ke I'll b give everyone COVID. Sneezing is getting out of hand. What are you doing out here? You better get home quick. New GF makes swords from almost anything. Oh, okay. Now you see, that's why I get it. I haven't read nor watched Chainsaw Man yet. <laughs> I know a good chunk about it, though. Not that part, though.
Only we're just the cold. Recently, people keep getting abducted, and really enough, it's only people who sneeze that get taken away. Doesn't matter if they're men, women, kids, or seniors, anyone can get taken. They do all come back after a while, but somehow they don't remember a thing about being abducted. Gives you the creeps, doesn't it? Only knows it's only people who sneeze that get taken away. You should be careful too, buddy. If you start sneezing, you better hide away in an inn or leave town. Hope that guy made it back home, all right. Wouldn't mind, could you check on him at home, just in case? I have to get back to work, you see, we're really busy at the moment. Oh yeah, you'll be fine though, right? I mean, you want to catch the bad guy. Either way, it's up to you now. Sneezing guy went that way across the bridge, then he turned left. The Hidden Doctor's Expedition. This is clearly more important than rescuing Telia. And he's dead. <laughs> Immediately dead. <laughs> oh my, excuse me, you there. Are you alright? What happened to him? <laughs> Sneezes once, gets fucking stabbed. <laughs> Do you know this boy? It's like he lost conscious for a while. Apart from that, he looked all right. This guy really scared and fainted, poor boy. He just happened to be passing by, so I don't know for sure. You see, a big shadowy figure came and tried to take him away, but I screamed and made it panic, then I left the boy and ran away. Good thing I only have a stuffy nose. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. They activate it. Did not. Okay. For now, CC. For now. I've heard of people getting abducted. Did you see what it looked like? <sighs> it's you. It's you, it's you, it's you, it's you, it's you. It's you, it's you, it's you, lady, it's you. You're the culprit. You are the culprit. You are the culprit. You are the culprit. You are the culprit. It's you. It's you. It's you. You're killing it. You, you're taking people. You. It's you. It's you. It's you. It's you. It's you. All right, I'll take care of that later. <laughs> now I'll actually go do plot. I can remember how to fuck to get out of here. I can't say I like the infrastructure here. I'd prefer other areas. I think I just met a serial killer. Oh well, off to see an egg. <laughs> exactly. Egg is more important. We prioritize our religion before everything else, including the well-being of others. That's how this works, right? He's better urban planning. Asshole, hold up a second. Don't try to stop me, Arya. There isn't a moment to lose. I have to get Tilia out of here. The regenerating monster's still in there, remember? One more reason why we can't sit around doing nothing. And if you lose, what then? Don't come to that. Just need to kill the one regenerating monster, right? Easy. Show me the way, please. Istina. So, you're finally admitting you're the Shadow Assassin. Hmm? Am I, though? I could just be keeping you on your toes and be no use to you whatsoever. Maybe I'm just maybe I'm just here to be sacrifice. Just be fodder. Good grief. Thank you. Not here for your thanks. I'm here because I want to be. I know keeping my mouth shut won't please any of you, so I'll tell you this. Too hot to sacrifice. <laughs> 
Fellas, I feel like you might be more down bad than I am. <laughs> I mean it when I say I don't want to use my ability. Even now I can feel my hands shaking. But if these shaking hands are able to save one life. Stina. I won't pretend to know your circumstances, but I am grateful for your help. And I'm sorry for being so pushy and awful earlier. It will happen again. Don't worry, I understand you needed to get a reaction out of me. Don't think anything of it. I'll just use my ability on you later. <laughs> oh, I think it's time for round two. Let's do this. You can organize your party under party in the menu when you're near Modus Monolite. You acquired the Shadow Walker job class. A job with great physical power. It deals a lot of damage to enemies weak to break in other status or abnormalities. She doesn't actually one hit to KO the enemy. We got scammed. <laughs> Unironically. And you know what? Let's have asshole. I like this loadout. This makes me happy. Why are my jobs? Ah, I'm still unemployed. Understood. Ants normal attack, blaze 2, flame tongue, increased fire damage. I'm upset Assault Savant doesn't have fire damage. Then we could really just be me. <laughs> Maybe later. Against normal attack, shorten job change, mode change two. <sighs> Man, it's only 940. Stop being a little bitch. Everybody is fucking British. Well, I'm going to make them all sound like Russian anyways. Because I feel like it. There it is. Monster in question. I've been too busy for cyberpunking. <laughs> She's hot. <laughs> so once again, I think y'all are more down bad than I am. I can't see its weak spot yet. You'll need to weaken it first. Got it easily done. Let's go. Circuit, set you on fire. Um... I wish there was like, I mean, it's kind of like Xenoblade, except there's no auto attack. That's what I'm reminded of. That's like a light version of Xenoblade's combat. There we go. Come on, let me set circuit on fire again. There we go! Didn't one hey KO the boss scammed. <laughs> uh, I think we can just do it real quick like that. There we go. Yeah. This isn't a one hit KO, this is just a nice ass. What a fucking ripoff. It's regenerating. Istina. I think my shadow ass is broken. Let's get a new one at Target. <laughs> hey, I'm down for going to Target. I go in there just to look around. It's just nice at Target. <laughs> Literally. I just enjoy, like, Target's just aesthetically nice. <laughs> Thank you. 
I'm just glad I haven't lost my touch. You really earned that title. There's no need for praise. It won't make me feel any better. I was first to learn how to kill people since I was able to walk. Ever heard of the Dark Brotherhood? And the Black Sacrament? <laughs> this made me realize that the only thing I know how to do right is destroy life. Stina. It's not true. You raised me back at orphanage, and your wonder with kids. Your past does not define identity. You can do so much more than kill. For example, you could maybe kiss your eyes on lips. I think you would like that a lot. <laughs> I'll kick anyone's ass who tries to tell you otherwise. I was not expecting him to just swear so bluntly like that. It's just like you said, Estina. The Shadow Assassin is nothing more than basis gossip. You are you, not some fable in book. You're a teacher at an orphanage who just happens to have a killer arm. You grew up to be a fine young man. Now, this isn't a place to stand around chatting. We need to start looking for Telia. I'll just make her British. Any other accent isn't, like, funny. So we'll just give her her accent. <laughs> Asshole, however, is funny as a Russian man. <laughs> Uh, something on your mind? I guess I'm just glad we have a guy like asshole around. I don't think I could handle that as smoothly. Come on, we should follow them. <laughs> Rise, you're dying. <sighs> Rise, you're dying. I'm gonna drink some vegetable Thanks. juice. There we go. Ryan, your lifesaver. You activated the mutant vegetation mo modus model light. Get his ass! Light circuit on fire! I'm gonna switch modes. There we go. <laughs> Thank you, Milla, for roasting circuit with me. <laughs> Ride the win! I think this is just called air. No! Ride the win! Going to the win. Win rad. Win rad. Win rad. Chest is immune to win. Small poison cores. Ladder. We really need to play the game if we want to win, guys. <laughs> we need to play the game and kill the enemies. We really, sh we sure are playing the game. I mean, we circuit 100%. No, 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 I didn't want to. Mm, why do I want to press X after I do that? <laughs> I don't understand. My claws hurt to cut. You mean your nails, CC? You're not a wolf, CC. No claws. Your nails, got it. <laughs> it could be a cat, though. I do not think CC has gone in his cat boy arc yet. Excellent clawed back in December. There's more wind to ride, but I don't got ride to wind. 
Oh, I got his ladder. Egg impression complete. Oh, we got silver ore. When do I unlock crafting? Crafting. I need to go find a way to upgrade my gear. Badly. <laughs> Something shiny catches your eye inside a cracked culture tank. The cracked glass is dangerous. You do you hear a crack in the glass and you shatters your gram, your arm gets cut, your health decreased, but you manage to hold on to that item. It looks like you got a small wind core. Everything's okay. Everything's fine. Everything won't be fine. Eating. Then I might beat the shit out of this. Actually, we're just gonna run. Let's go around the next save point because we are closing in on 10 o'clock, which means we're closing in on midnight. We're closing in on midnight. Some plant is in the way. Not this shit again, are you serious? I can't wait to get another potion. Need more potions, I'm working on it. Well, I can at least do this. Make our trek a little easier. Thankfully got a million repair kits. Switch on the wall with lots of small holes around it. We're gonna find out. Gets louder by the minute until it bursts smoke erupts. Noxious smell makes you feel unwell. You feel sick to your stomach. Cool. That's straw buddy seeds. All right, yeah, we're using the bell like now. We're using the bell now. There we go. <laughs> With 40 health left. <laughs> now let's hit the hay. Taking good care of your flying bug friend. Uh, I need more levels up. I need more level ups. We got 3,825 gorillas. Flying bug friend, uh, the fairy that helps us with our crops. That flying bug friend. Right, let's put some of this shit away. There and that there. There. Can't cook shit. Bet. I suppose we can go to town and sell more of our monies. But first, let me plant these straw buddies. They're buddies, but they're made of straw. Like Bubble Buddy from SpongeBob. Good morning. Oh, 
Oh, you need three for it. I didn't know that. You're my strawberry. Aww. Thank you, Mila. <laughs> You're my strawberry too. Love you. <laughs> and love you too, Circuit. Love you too, CC. Love you too, Cringe, if you're still here. Hard to tell with Cringe. He's a big lurker. Uh, so I need... Let's just go buy more seeds. Die, die. Ugh. I need McDonald's to open faster. This is bullshit. But a production potential frontier shows a negative slope curve between Liddy and I. What? <laughs> that sure is that thing you just said, CC. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You'll have to balance your opportunity costs. Now, I know what opportunity costs is. I don't know what Lud I don't know what Mila has to do with it. <laughs> I'm done arting for the day. My brain is done, dude. <laughs> I feel it. How the fuck do artists exist? <laughs> pain. We exist through pain. That's how we exist. Okay. Uh, uh, where's the armory? Actually, I want to get stronger. I want to beat people to death better. Riz through the pain. Are you telling me to flirt with my drawings? I don't think I should do that with the Kana one right now. Uh, she she kind of has a she kind of got a boyfriend recently. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think it was a good idea beforehand either. Uh, I do not have enough copper ore. Need more copper ore. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Let's try the general store. We do want to buy those trees. I want to buy one of those trees. All right, fellas, which one do we want? Do we want to grow some grapes or we want to grow some chestnuts? What are we feeling like? I'm personally on team chestnut. Nut. <laughs> Nuts. <laughs> uh, I, want, I need a third opinion, CC. How do we feel? Do we want nut or do we want... <laughs> grape. Unfortunately, nut does outweigh us. Democracy. I love democracy. <laughs> uh, uh, let's buy a few eggs. Three eggs. Egg. And a couple milk. And let's see here. And I'm getting tired of my backpack being small. There we go. Span backpack. Uh, 
Uh, I'm doing math. Four wheat. We could get a lot of grass. You can get a lot of weed. Fuck it. Can finally touch grass. <laughs> Bread rules. <laughs> Get gluten, no. Bread isn't keto, CC. And grass isn't digestible, however. We do not care about our gut health. Grass. 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 I feel like my farm would give anyone with like organizational OCD a goddamn stroke. <laughs> Apologies to anyone in chat right now who might be hating my guts. You're totally fair too, though. Indeed. <laughs> I'd like to plant the tree. Am I unable to plant the tree here? Oh! It needs four spaces. Ew. That's gross. Just making sure. Okay. I still can't do anything about that. I don't want to put it in the middle of all this shit, though. I just want to smack it right in the middle. That's even grosser. Should have organized it better. I am. Or I'm attempting to organize it. I want to put the trees back here and have the main crops here. I am attempting to organize it. I'm unable to because I can't break the fucking rocks. <laughs> uh, God. Let me go inside and make illegal explosives. <laughs> like so. Two bombs. There we go. There were things to blow up over there. I had no op ways to deal with it. Great backpack. There we go. You aren't using the land most productively, Rise The guilt is eating you up. Literally, I'm using it as productively as possible right now. I will have circuit time you out for two seconds again. Do not tempt me. CC wouldn't, like, actually get banned if he got timed out a bunch of times, would he? Switch away to Suma ban. I sure hope not. <laughs> I don't want him banned. <laughs> it wouldn't, okay. <laughs> so my threat holds weight. <laughs> uh, alrighty. Next ad is coming up. So we're gonna go ahead, take one more break for the night. We're probably gonna go for one more hour after this because it is closing on like a ow. I hit my elbow on my desk, lovely. Uh, it is closing in on uh, 11 for me, which is usually around when I am my stream times. So uh, y'all go ahead, get one more good stretch, get one more good drink, get one more good bathroom break, do whatever y'all humans need to do. And we're going to be back in just a minute. So with all that being said, bye for now.
Howdy, howdy, everybody. Hope y'all had a good break. Um, CC, what do you mean by gifted and subs aren't showing up? Did you, like, did you gift something and, uh, j like, just now and it didn't show up? Or, um, are you talking about, like, the, uh, are you talking about, like, the leaderboards? Because I've come to the conclusion that those, like, reset. Yeah, I, yeah, I think those reset. I don't think there's a way for me, to my knowledge, there is no way for me to uh, extend the window. No, I've seen them reset on other channels. There are other channels that I know there are people that have given way more gift subs than, um, that, that have given way more gift subs overall than are listed. So I have seen it happen. Other VTR guys got him up above 300. Then maybe it's something I can edit. On. Uh, let's see here. Your rewards. Immunity. Content. And I, I might have to. I might have to look into it. You can set it to all time gift subs. Is that uh is that on the person? Is that on my end or on uh the viewers end, Milla? Also, by the way, you have VIP now. <laughs> I gave it to you during the break. <laughs> uh On your end, rise, but do it after stream. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> uh, also, thank you for giving me two mouths, CC. I'm sure everyone's eardrums will be elated for this. Uh, there we go. Perfect. Everything's perfect. Ah! It's iconic. Uh, yeah, I'll have to look into that. Cause I've never ah. Well, hi, Ellie. <laughs> uh, I hope you're having a good day, buddy. How's life treating you right now? Uh, I'm hoping we can organize uh, tabletops and soon with everybody. Cause I really wanna, I really wanna try down Moody again, but I also really, really. Really want to play Pokemon Master Trainer with that mod I found. <laughs> I know Cringe is already completely down for it. I need to go back to Egg. What am I doing? <laughs> We're back on the fish ladies again, I see. I also don't know why I went back here. <laughs> I'm currently dueling cringe and dueling so it depends how the fish lady looks yeah that's my opinion there's a scale heh <laughs> scale like fishes fish scales ha funny funny joke laugh <laughs> pun minus two it's iconic <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, I think CC's. I, I think we're still waiting on cooldown right now. All right, let's see here. Let me switch to uh, shit that can heal me. Ah, there it goes. <laughs> Circuits of using his mod privileges again. Why is the Civil Feral toggle not working? I need to look into that one. That one should absolutely be working. Last time it had a bit of a delay though. 
Oh, there it goes. It has... Bro, why does it have a giant fucking delay? Is it like that for other things? Hold on. And thank you, Milla. It is iconic. <laughs> Let me, do, let me try firearms. Let me test firearms. So firearms is this instant. Ask Risk about it. <laughs> no. <laughs> firearms is fine. All the other ones are fine. It's a civil feral toggle that decides to take 10 fucking years. We better stay away from that enemy. I'm glad everyone's having fun with the channel point redeems right now, though. <laughs> Given that was like a big like thing I was like fixated on when it came to getting affiliate. I'm glad everyone's having a good time with it. The locate potions. Potion seller. I require your finest potions. Potion seller. Blue potion. Quick, light circuit on fire. <laughs> Harvest still will be busting. <laughs> okay, let me look at the description of this fucking potion. Because I want to have a game design rant. <laughs> I still think it's dumb. I would never call this shit a potion. Suspicious look within a bottle dissolves walls of blue plants. Shut the fuck up, Circuit. I'm gonna light you on fire again. I mean, it was gonna happen anyway. But now I'll have a purpose. And there's just chests back here. Tingle Radish. <laughs> Right, let's blow up this wall. <laughs> May I offer you an egg in these potion times. <laughs> Burian loves all chests. <laughs> Hermit's root. May I become a hermit after this fucking potion bullshit? It always falls for mimics. <laughs> That's adorable. Haha, <laughs> you can't get me, I'm on a ladder! You don't know how height works! You live in two dimensions! You are weak! And have one eye! Hey yo, what's up here? The hell going on? Oh god, they're coming. Well, we got another red potion. You know what that means? Poorly worded puzzle. I'm so mad. Everyone, stop dying, please. You are not required to be this much of a little bitch. Oh, uh, is there a thingy? I want a thingy. I want a fast travel thingy. I want to watch Furian at some point. I, it's just time. Also, I want to finish reading Land of the Lost just first. 
Okay, hold on. Wow. This cutscene goes on. I want to test out the civil feral toggling him. Oh, uh, it's still off. I mean, it's still on cooldown. Yeah, I'll just have to look into that later. <laughs> this is a cultivation pod, but it looks like it was abandoned a long, long time ago. What's cultivation pod used for? A vessel used to grow living things, or oftentimes create them from nothing. Hold on, just a moment. Harry thought this place seemed suspicious, but you're telling me life was once created here? What is this place, and why do you know so much about it, Arya? Well, you see, Arya is... Explain Arya's past. I must say, I find that all hard to believe, so let's pretend I never asked. <laughs> it's none of my business anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I did ask, and I regret asking. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Oh, nothing. It just caught my attention. But finding Telia is our priority. I'm sorry. Let's keep going. This sure is blue. Must have been their end product. Would be funny if I could just break it. <laughs> Smash it real quick. It'll be fine. I need to, uh... There. There we go. Progress. Progression. You have to progress in the game in order to win. I need... Oh, repair kit level 2. Okay, that's a thing I'll need to unlock later. Lighting circuit on fire. There we are. <laughs> Thank you, Mila. Thank you, Mil Mil. Love you. How strong is it anyway? Thirty. I am not that. I know your weakness. You lack depth perception. You have that perception. <laughs> well then, shall we begin? Divine creature. I never noticed that name at first. <laughs> Soft cotton. We can make new clothes, except we probably can't. Looks like somebody's journal entry has been left open. More tests today. Why must we keep doing something so mind-numbing day after day? I keep saying this is for peace. Defeating the enemy will bring peace. What if I do? Will I finally be free? I am the dragon that will bring peace. Ayo, hey, who found my diary? Dragons are the most powerful beings in history. I'm master of the sky. Not that I know what that means. What is our enemy? What do they want me to fight? I had harvest all again my fucking diary, bro. It's just private. We better stay away from that enemy. You don't say, asshole. You only said it like five hundred fucking times. Let's get the chest. We like we're like Freerian. Wisty Peach. Mining away. Ladder. Feel sleepy. Yeah. Probably go home. Also, yay! I can do damage. I can, big, I can do big damn egg. I'd rather wait for that, to be honest, because I'm not changing my jobs at all. So 
So I'm just, I think I'm just gonna wait till I can enhance my normal attack. This little green dot's gonna drive me insane though. Big damage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, more like big damn egg. This egg. Egg cult. Big damn egg. <laughs> you know, Mill Mill found that funny, so that's all I care about. <laughs> How long until Quietus? How long till the anti-nature beats my ass? You cumble. Grass. Grass. Dress lettuce. Harvesting crops to play the game. Ayo. Chat, what kind of juice we want to make? Yeah, a lot of options. We can make more vegetable juice. We could make we could make the Stina tea. <laughs> could use this hermit's root, or we can make more spicy water. <laughs> <It's> Tina. <laughs> got it. <laughs> I'm glad we were on the same page, Mill. All right, let's move some shit over. Use to fortify weapons. Soft cotton, bam, bam. Okay, then a root that can be used in medicine seems to grow well in sheltered areas. Put that there, put that there. I just realized I was putting this all in the uh, in the shipping box, and I don't want to do that. <laughs> Let's fix that. I don't want to sell everything here. That is the opposite of what I wanted to do. We can sell the cucumber, though. Not this. I paid 2,000 fucking gorillas for that shit. 2,000 fucking harambes. That's a hip old meme from a real life event. Okay, uh, hey, you know, what? let's grab a few milks. Bro, you, bro, if we just shove a whole ass fucking egg in our mouth, <laughs> gives us 600 HP. <laughs> Raw eggs, because they're cliche. <laughs> oh, we'll take an egg with us for luck. Okay, I think we're good right now. <laughs> Yeg! <Yeah>, Proteins. <laughs> Okay. You know, it's funny. One of my big fears about making this a regular game was I thought it wouldn't be a very good stream game. And I'm very glad I've been proven wrong on that. <laughs> Farm work is pretty good wing exercise. Shut up, bug. Ugh. Rainy, it does seem like Tuesday is just a good day for my streams in general. I'll be honest. I've noticed that Thursdays have... Uh, are definitely my weakest day. Because I guess everyone is just busy, generally. 
because I had the Curry Air I'd collab last week with Nova. That was genuinely some of the most fun I've ever had on a collab. And the most fun I've had on a stream in general. And like, it was like, that. we had like two instances where the viewers shot up above two. And like, I knew it wasn't the stream quality that day, so I just assumed everyone was busy. <laughs> Like, we had some tech issues, but, like, I, like, it was completely offset. <laughs> Just a busy-ass day, so I am, right? Maybe I should start putting less, um, high stake streams on Thursday? Like the collab? I don't even know why I came here, to be honest. <laughs> I think I wanted to go to the store, but I have no money, so I'm just gonna go home. Throw them on Friday? I can't throw them on Friday. I work on Friday. I work Friday night, unless you want a morning stream. Even then, it's looking like I might be doing D&D campaigns on Friday morning. Hmm. <laughs> Because I might have started organizing some of my co-workers into doing a D&D campaign. <laughs> so I need to go and buy Lost Minds of Fandelver, like, tomorrow. Because <laughs> I lost mine. I need to buy a new starter kit. I got all the books, though, so we're good on that front. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, they're, the thing is, they're all newbies. They are all newbies. I need the starter kit. It's also been a while since I have DM'd. It's been ages. So I really need to fix that. They're about to get their shit pushed in. Mm. Well... Is there a better starter campaign that I could... Because it, it needs to be something I can throw together quickly. It needs to be something I can throw together really fucking quickly. I can't think of much else other than Lost Minds. Not really? Okay, yeah. <laughs> mm. But yeah, I feel like I should... Lost Sheep is your standard first game, but it's a one-shot. Mm. I mean, maybe that would be enough to just get them into the game. Because, like I said, they're all newbies. All of them are newbies. I'm introducing them to D&D. So, having some pre-made character sheets... You can do a one-shot into some other shang champagne. <laughs> campaign? Yeah, definitely. One module into another, yeah, definitely. But I just want, I just want to run the campaign, see what they think, and if they like it, yeah. Now we have a whole thing going. Now I'm gonna ask them if they want to make their own characters too. I'm gonna ask them that. I'm gonna be like, okay, so we have two options here. We can either make our characters, which could take a while, or I can just throw some pre-made at you and we just see how we like the game first. So we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully they pick. Pre hopefully they pick pre-made because some of the people I've invited are not. They don't do the best with a lot of information at once, but I I, I feel confident I can ease them into it. I'm kind of oh, good when I start teaching people shit. I tend to be kind of good if I have like full control over like the co the coursework, you know. Set Zircon on fire. Come on. There we go. But no, yeah, I definitely think I, um... I definitely think I need to start moving some of my lower my lower stake streams onto Thursday instead of putting higher stake ones there. Cuz it's pretty clear that most of my regulars can't really make Thursday right now. I don't want to stop streaming on Thursday though because that's one of the only days I really have to stream at my regular time. 
so I want to like still stream on Thursday but as of right now I don't want like big events on that day and save those for Tuesday and Wednesday so you switch on the wall well, opposite there's a green switch with a shutter shutter might open if you press the switch And reveal a monster. The monster attacks. The battle begins. That is a walk in the park. I didn't think the red and green color coding would be that obvious. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and drink some juice. Really, no, we'll drink milk. There we go. Trying to find a ladder. Ah, uh, ladder is over that way. Set circuit on fire. Five E is one of the easier tabletops to get into. Oh yeah, absolutely. It was my first two. Personally, I would rather play Pathfinder now. But that's going to be significantly hard to find people I'm comfortable playing with. <laughs> okay, so... Hmm. Pathfinder 2 is just a better system? Yeah, it is. I think it's a lot more fun, but it's also more complicated. Yeah, I'm very excited. I'm very excited for Friday. I'm gonna have to text the people I got uh, involved about it. And ask them what they want to do for characters. God, I love not being dependent on dice. <laughs> yeah, definitely. That was the- that- that's what I like the most. I'm not completely fucked by a dice roll. Sure, that's part of the fun and all, but... By God. It sucks to be like, goddamn 1000 a stat and you can't do this very basic action just because you rolled a 1. There we go. Drink some more milk. Ryan, your lifesaver. It also sucks to roll just horrible, horrible stats on your character creation. That's why I do point by now. F fuck rolling for stats. It's not worth it. <laughs> Looks like somebody's journal entry has been left open. I said the tests were finished. I never thought such a day would come. We are weapons. Our only purpose is to fight and survive. That's what those people said. But does a weapon need a soul? Why was I born? Who was I born to kill? If that is my purpose, then I don't want to live. I don't want to hurt anyone. Okie dokie. What am I doing with my life? This can only go well. Oh, the ladder is over there. Stay away from that enemy. You don't say, asshole. Hello. I see we are having a gathering. Would you care to see one of my mods be lit on fire? There we go. 
That was a walk in the park. And we'll get some vegetable juice for our next heal. How many repair kits do I have left? Wait. Do I only need one? Because it, I swear on my life, it hasn't gone down by bef beyond eight. Well, actually, I might have made more. I don't think I did. I'm gonna switch my stats again. No. Not again! Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Stay away from that enemy. I did not know I was playing Metal Gear today. All right, I got the I got the red potion, the questionably named red potion. Still mad about this shit. <laughs> Please get over there. Please get over there. Thank God. I can't defeat this one. I missed one of the dolls. I missed the marketable plushie. I'm sad. At least you figured it out. I'm still mad. Just got you suspicious liquid in a bottle. It dissolves walls of blue plants. Please shoot. Circuit, can you time yourself out? Mm -hmm. Make it 22 seconds. I'm afraid I cannot time myself out. What do I even pay you for? Also, I missed a journal entry. Then it's left behind in the remains of the wall plant. You look closely, it's a zombie mushroom. I get paid? <laughs> I mean, eventually, <laughs> ideally. We'll see how things work out in the future. <laughs> if I become the next big Twitch streamer. Oh boy. It's like somebody's journal entry. Life is such a dull thing. If we break, we don't work anymore. That's it. Humans are no different from machines. Our hearts make them so weak. For how long do they carry such a fragile organ? Humans are slaves to hearts. They can't disobey them. Run for your lives, broken puppets. The puppets dance. The marionettes cannot bleed. They just spin and spin. Right round, baby. Right round. Like a record, baby. Right, right round, round. Cease and desist notification from the Ethics Committee. This project has committed severe ethical violations. We demand immediate suspension, destruction of all records. The following must appear before the central government. Ah, so that's where she is. Do not have the level two bomb. Ah, you bitch. We found her. Telia. There she is. Asshole. Telia, you're okay. We've been looking all over for you. Come, we are going home. 
No, don't come any closer. I'm A posing to assert dominance. What? Why would you say that? You mustn't take another step. Please, just forget about me and leave. There's no way I'm just leaving the here. I'm fine, really, so just leave. Delia. Fuck. My one weakness. Elevator. We must create a Russian space program to get up there. Don't understand. It all makes sense now. What did you find? It's still a theory, but we're getting close to confirming it. Asshole, you might not like what happens next. But please don't turn away. She's going to need you now more than ever. Question mark. I need another modus monolite. Please and thank you. Seat of the Dragon Modus Monolite. Hey yo, get the fuck out my chair! I don't have any usable items. I feel something unusual up ahead. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big boy. It's him. The egg god. He has such weak little arms. Can't relate. Delia. Asshole. I told you not to follow. <laughs> Where did such a giant monster come from? Delia, get away from it. It's fine. They're not going to harm me. Don't be stupid, Delia. Come. It's time to go home. I'm sorry, asshole. I can't do that. Why? When I was really young, I read Aragon, and I thought it was so cool to ride a dragon. I couldn't resist, asshole. I remembered what I had forgotten. Your memory came back. They did. I am a bionic unit created in this very laboratory for the purpose of controlling these dragons. I'm an artificial human, or rather, a weapon given human form. I'm nothing like you, asshole. <laughs> I don't understand. Suspected this laboratory is from my time, saw on the news a lab that used bionic units to control weapons, but it was shut down. I have no idea why it's here in the first time, though. The researcher did say they based the weapon design on a dragon. This dragon is a weapon designed with the express purpose to kill, and I am a component of it. The monsters were destroying Nemia because they were trying to find me, hence why they only stole girls. That is the truth, asshole. I didn't want you to know. Delia. I can't stay with you any longer. I'm a weapon. That's not... That's not true. <laughs> oh, asshole. Weapon or not, I know it's in your heart, Delia. Doesn't matter where you were born to do on this planet. You can choose and change your path. That's why... Thank you, asshole. I'm glad I could spend my last moments with you. But our time together is over. I will revive the dragons, and then I will lock away our consciousness. Without a chain of command, the dragons will destroy anything they cannot identify. How to train your dragon, not how to train your Delia. <laughs> Since this time is not their own, they would destroy everything. Asshole. The time we had together was short, but I loved our town. Everyone was so kind and warm to me. But the one to teach me I had a heart, the splendid, wonderful thing, was you. That is why. Mila is going to steal you from me and marry you instead. <laughs> this is the real reason I'm up here. I'm sad as shit, man. <laughs> Why don't you destroy me? I don't want to harm this world. 
the townsfolk, the children, you. Please, asshole, you have to stop me. Delia! That's a huge bitch! All right, asshole, time to kill your girlfriend. Whoa, okay. Oh God, we are not prepared for this. I am not prepared for this at all. <laughs> oh God. Get the fuck out of here. I want to get out of here. Oh God. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna win, but I'm gonna go to. I ain't going down without a fight. Where'd he go? Hello. This battle's really cool. <laughs> Get the fuck out of there! Egg! I cannot find other things to eat. Oh wait, no. This can heal us. Don't go over there. There's things that can hurt me over there. Is there nothing else that can heal me? This can. Let's see if we can find more shit to heal us. <laughs> That's our last healing item. Oh God, get out, get out. Uh, yeah, I am. If I get hit one more time, uh, I can't use it. And there we go. <laughs> I gave it a good shake. <laughs> I gave it a good shake. I gave everything I had. 
<laughs> My god, I gave everything I had. Ugh. Hmm. Oh man, that was actually a really cool boss fight. Jesus Christ. <laughs> that was actually really cool. Oh, you're awake. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Why were you fighting a fucking dragon? <laughs> uh, how much did I pay? 400. Cool. Keeps going up. Fucking inflation. Well. Let's see what's going on with the crops. <laughs> and then we will probably end. Because <laughs> I need to grind healing items now. Rainbow bean, sure. Uh, common plant often seen in Farns Meadows, mainly used as livestock feed while we're selling all of it. Peach juice. Damn, that's a lot of HP. God damn. We could upgrade our weapons now, though. We have a little more- well, no, we need four copper. At least for my weapon. Plant some carrots. There we go. Perfect. All right. I believe that's enough for today. <laughs> Go ahead, turn back on some music for us. There we go. And let's switch back over the chat. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> All righty. Let's find, uh, let's find someone to raid, shall we? <laughs> <sighs> Who we got? Got Lobotomy Bunny doing art. Perhaps. Nobody else really. Yeah, this is Ray Bunny. Good old reliable money. <laughs> Go ahead and hit start rate on that real quick. Uh, Okie dokie. Well, I had a lot of fun today. I had a lot of fun today. <laughs> I hope y'all had a lot of fun too. Y'all really made the stream that much better. <laughs> uh, but as for what's going on the rest of the week, <laughs> gotta keep the streak going. He knows. <laughs> hmm. As for what's going on the rest of the week, um, tomorrow's art, we're going to be working on the Kana piece again some more. And then after that, um, we're going to be finishing off. And I am going to finish it off. I'm going to try and ma I, I will try to marathon the rest of it. And there's the D&D campaign I need to take into account now. But I'm going to try and finish off Link's Awakening on Friday because I want that one done with <laughs> we need to finish that game we're very close to the end we need to finish it <laughs> uh but yeah i had a really good day i had a really good stream today i, I always love my str the streams when i come back they're always such a fucking blast dude y'all really do make it like I, I i'm funny enough to myself but i really do my best bouncing off other people <laughs> Uh, but yeah, thank you to everyone for coming. Thank you, Circa. Thank you, Cece. Thank you, Cringa. Thank you, Mila. Thank you, Ellie. Thank you, everybody. Y'all have a good day, night, afternoon, wherever y'all are. Whatever the fuck you're doing. And bye, bye guys. Y'all have a good one. <laughs>